Hello friends and my lovelies, welcome to Amanda's Crafty Corner. I am Amanda and this is my Crafty Corner. I hope everyone is having a fantastic Friday. Woo! It's Friday, time for the weekend. I know here, sorry, where I live, it is a nice long weekend. Sorry, I'm just turning on my backlight. And I get four days off since I don't work on Tuesday. So, yay. Again, I hope everyone is doing well. Sorry, my chair is sliding on me, so you might be hearing that. Um, my floor is a little slanted with my corner. But anyways, welcome back to day five of working on day five or day six sorry day six of working on this lovely diamond painting which is a tree coming out from a book sitting on a book whatever you want to call it uh last time i said we might do one of the bigger sections so we could do the b's or the n's or even like the w's I'm feeling this navy blue. I don't know about the rest of you, but I think I'm going to do H20. I'm just going to look for it. I know I have it here. Yep. So it is like a dark navy blue sort of color. So I'm going to set that up. Let me know how your day is in the comments. If you have any plans for the weekend. I do. I have a barbecue. That my partner, my son, and I were all going to. So that should be fun. The rest of the weekend is just for relaxing. After a long and hectic week at work. And next week is also going to be hectic for some of my co-workers. Since two of us are away on the Tuesday. And there are three doctors. So good luck to my co-workers. But they'll be fine. They normally are. So yeah. Otherwise, I don't really have much to say. I figured I have time to record today. So let's get to these bees. Nice big section. I don't know how long I'll record for. I do have time, but, you know, I only do one placement at a time. So maybe I'll do about a half hour, maybe 25 minutes. I don't know. Maybe a little bit longer. We shall see. So we're getting the bees slowly done. Yeah, I covered up the other section with this paper. It's good for um, resting your arm on and to keep the dust out since I get rid of that plastic that they put it in like that protective sheet I hate it I, I'm not a fan of it so I just put these papers on top because it also kind of helps me section it out frame it out for what I'll be doing I'm just holding it since it keeps moving now yeah I gave my ballerina that I had finished. That was a square diamond painting. That is in my DIY Choose unboxing. I finished that and gave it to my coworker. Her daughter loves it. Um, I asked her to let me know if her son wants anything because he uh, he photobombed the picture of uh, her daughter's reaction. It was really cute. Move that there. There we go. But yeah, it's great to spend time with my lovelies. Yes, I'm calling you my lovelies because some of you like cross stitch, some of you like diamond painting, and some of you like one or the other or both. So rather than calling you anything else, you're my lovelies. I also hope you guys are working on a diamond painting with me and that you have 
a drink or some food. I just had a very, very late lunch of peppercorn shrimp, which was actually really good, but it was, I get it from HelloFresh, but it was more of a snack than an actual meal because it did not feed enough. We each got just a little bit, not even a handful, but that's okay. We're going to have burgers later. And then I get to have burgers tomorrow. So fun times all around. On another exciting note, my brother, who is a baker, will be gone for three weeks. He is going down to Manhattan to do some nice training. So I wish him luck with that. We will miss him. But at the same point in time, I really don't see him since he sleeps all day and he's up all night because he works a night job. And as a baker, you rarely see people because of the times that they start. I'm sure some of you know that. Their start times are like 2, 3, 4, 5 in the morning. And then by the time that they get home, they just want to sleep anyways. Right, does anybody know a baker in their family or has a friend that's one and understand what I'm saying and feeling? Maybe. We will also get as much done as this as possible because that's my brain. My brain just kind of froze. And yeah. If you have any questions, comments, please let me know. Please comment. Please like my videos. Go check out my other videos, my unboxing videos. On Monday, we will be doing the Keeper of the Moon River. And I think we should come up with a backstory for her. As I'm stitching, we should come up with a story. I think that's what my Mondays will be. Stories of the different keepers as we cross stitch them together. And then I will figure out maybe a set day for just diamond painting or another cross stitch. You let me know in the comments what you want to see. I'm here for you. I'm here for myself as well, but I'm mostly here for you. I love diamond painting. I love cross stitching. So, yeah. Here we go. Just shake that a little bit. I have lots of these little trays. So, I'm never worried about running out for each and every diamond. Not only that, I think on one side it's mostly like one color and it might change when we go to the other side. Who knows? I guess we will find out as we finish. And I say that because look, there's a new color here. Here's a new color. This has a mixture of new colors. But for the most part, it is all like the blues, the blue grays. And of course, no, the other one is also like a navyish blue that looks kind of black, 939. They're very shiny, however. I love how shiny these uh, little diamonds are. Sorry, I've gone silent. I'm still trying to think of what to say. Oh, my little man was so cute last night when I was putting him to bed. So he has a floor bed that's in the shape of a car. I fit in it with him. Yep, I fit in his bed. So 
normally what I will do is I will lie with him only for like a minute or so. And then we have a twin bed in his bedroom that I use also as a changing table. But then I lie down on it to help him go to sleep. And then I leave as soon as he's asleep. But anyways, I went to lay down with him and he looked up at me and he goes, I'm tired. And then he grabbed my arm. While we were under the, the blanket together, he wrapped it around his body and not even, not even a minute later did he pass out. Like I hear his heavy breathing and I'm just like, you're going to melt my heart. This is the fastest you've ever gone to sleep for me because normally you fight me for sleep. But he, he was tired. He did not nap. And that's how I know he also not doesn't nap is when he's, I'm tired and he's ready to just conk out. Because this kid doesn't know if he wants to give up his naps or not. Next summer, yes, definitely he has to give them up because he goes to school in 2024. But, uh, yeah. For now, when he can nap, believe me, I put him down. And he will sleep a good two hours, if not three, depending on when he falls asleep. What do I mean by that? If he falls asleep at 12, he can sleep till 3 o'clock. If he falls asleep at 2 in the afternoon, he wakes up at 3.30 because I need him to sleep that night. That will probably be, sorry, that will probably be the case tomorrow. Because we're outside all day, he will look at me, I'm tired, put him in the stroller, go for a walk, and he will fall asleep. Because that's how he is. So I will dress him up nice and comfy, and we will go from there tomorrow. Yay, yeah, yeah. right there. Trying to keep my hand out of the way while I do this so you guys can see. Because this section is huge. This one, as I said, I will try to do all on camera. I will not do this one off the of camera. And then once we're done this one, we'll work on a big one together. One of the bigger designs that I have. My friend Moose. Yeah, I don't call him that. But my friend Moose would like to see the goddess one done on camera, so I will do that one next. I just can't remember if it is square or circle. I'll have to take a look at that. Because when it's square, well, I don't have extra square diamonds. I only have a whole bunch of the round. But that's okay. If I have to buy square diamonds, believe me, I will. So I'm popping up. There we go. Shake that. There we go. Let me know what you're working on in the comments. I'd like to know. We can have a whole discussion. And again, please follow my Instagram. The link is in will be in the description box. Um, come and join my Discord. I don't really use Facebook. I'm not a fan of it. I'd rather talk to everybody on Discord. The link will also be in that description box in the in the description box, sorry. Come and join. We can have lots of laughs together. You can message me on there. You can email me if you want.
You can message me on Instagram. It is all there. Feel free to follow me. I do my best to post my work and my whips. Especially as I'm trying to work on them every night. Sometimes it's hard. But I will do my best. To always, sorry, to always give updates. Sorry, my brain went kaputs for a second there. See if I can flip that. There we go. Grab it. What do you guys think of this color? Isn't it pretty? This navyish blue. It makes all the other colors pop. What is going on there? Let's see if I can do that. There we go. I just scooch some over because I'm like, I can still see a bee. What is going on? Because for the most part, you get a full coverage with, there it is. With these beads, well, diamonds, whatever you want to call them. Oh, yes, my coworker's son also thought they were actual diamonds. I'm like, no, they're not. And she goes, no. Or not, or else we'd be rich. If only, right? If only. Here we go. Come on. Here we go. We're slowly getting this section done here. This leads into this. And we will see how far we get today. I'm wondering, is this too blurry for you? If I come out, no, come out a little bit more. Let's go in. There. Since you don't really need to see this part, but as long as this isn't blurry, at least I hope it's not. My hand doesn't look blurry. Maybe. Let's see. No, my hand's not blurry. I'm trying different things. Please, again, let me know in the comments if there's anything I need to fix. I know sometimes my logo comes upside down. I don't know why it does that. I'm doing my best to fix that as well. One of my top commenters um and is okay is the one that uh designed it for me thank you so much you are amazing yeah i will do my best to make sure that it stops going upside down I'm just going to take a quick drink of my tea that I have. Don't mean to be super loud in your ear, but sometimes you just need a drink, you know? I wasn't so much on the phone today, but it certainly felt like it. Mostly because we were trying to help out on Tuesday when it's only like two of them. So we did all the calls for next week. I did all the two-week calls for, they're just reminder calls for, for patients. Uh, for today and for Monday, my coworker did basically the rest of them. 
which is amazing of her. And the reason why she did a lot of it is because I kept getting pulled to do testing. And testing can take anywhere from two minutes to 20 minutes. Why? Because it just depends on what we're testing for. Okay, so this camera is about to run out of time. I will be back in a moment. And I am back. Welcome back, everybody. Sorry about that. The Sometimes where I record, it has like a time limit, so I'm trying to be good about it. But we've done a fair bit in the time that we've done this painting. So I hope everyone got a drink, went to the bathroom, has a snack, or is even working on a diamond painting now. I am once again rolling away from my table. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn you like this. I'm going to attempt to roll up whoop, underneath my desk and keep working. So let's do this. Bring you closer. How is that? Everybody can see. I certainly hope so. I can always move what needs to be moved, so don't you worry. Yeah, well, yep, yeah, I got it. We'll work on this for maybe another 10 minutes and then I will see you again after that. So let's keep working away. There we go. You're probably wondering again why I'm working right to left instead of left to right. It's just so that you guys can see without my hand being in the way. Because I'm also using a finger whoop, to hold my canvas down. Yeah, some of my Diamonds have apparently decided they're going to jump. Here we go. If we don't get done at least one section in the next 10 or so minutes, there is always next time. But at least you got to see a pretty color, right? But they're all pretty. So we will just keep working away. I think I have another package coming. I'm not 100% sure. Um, for another unboxing video. If not, I do plan to get some more diamond paintings and cross stitch so once I get more product I will definitely do more unboxings with you I am working on a couple projects right now in regards to cross stitch for diamond painting this is actually my only one but we'll definitely I'll definitely be working on more soon again everything will be posted up on my Instagram and my Discord. So please, please, please follow me on there. It is Amanda's Crafty Corner. Um, and then the Discord link will also be in the description box.
This one doesn't want to cooperate. Let's find another one. As you can tell, I'm kind of bouncing around with where I'm putting the diamonds, but this is all the, the same section. So let's It's very pretty, isn't it? Again, I got this one off of Timu. Um, but most of them I will I get off of Amazon and you'll see from my unboxing videos. So I have lots and lots of diamond paintings. I will do my best to do some on camera for you. Some of them I will do um, on my own personal time. But I will do my absolute best. For everyone. Also let me know if there's a specific design that you're not sure about getting. I'm more than happy to get it. I'm more than happy to test things out on, on camera for you guys, especially because, you know, when you want to get something and you're unsure about a product, I will definitely review it for you. Um, or even, like I said, I will do the project in front of you so that you can see and then you can decide if you want to buy it for yourself. I know some people just don't have the time to do diamond paintings, but like I said, I am, sorry, I'll do that, see if that stops the blinking. Uh, I will sell completed projects. Just message me. If there's something that you really like, but you don't have the time to do, I'll do it for you. You don't have to worry about shipping or any of that. I will basically put the, all of that in my price and I'm not going to make it oh my goodness you're going to spend so much money no 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 don't worry about any of that the most I will charge anybody for a completed project is probably around $80 just because again it's it's my time instead of your time I'm the one oh my goodness what is going on okay let's see if I can Raise this up to make this happier. And then we'll do that. Maybe it'll be happy like that instead of blinking. I'm not 100% sure why it's blinking. I wish I could give you an answer. But we're almost done anyways. I'm just going to grab a couple more diamonds. But yes, as I was saying, so the most I'll ever charge is $80 Canadian. That includes the frame and shipping. And I lost a diamond, but that's okay. So you just have to message me, private message me, email me. Again, my email will be in the description box. I think I'll do a couple more. Yeah, we'll do one more kind of row, or maybe two more, two more rows. If I can get the diamonds to behave. I definitely need to get new pens. Because I know after a while, even like the, the tips of the pens here, they get wonky as well. This one I just got off of Amazon. It came in a pack of three for in Canadian dollars, like twelve ninety-nine. Not sure what it would be in your currency. But like I say, with some of my unboxing videos, a lot of the companies that you can buy from 
will also have their own accessories. So you can do that. Because most of them also have a discount when you spend X amount of dollars. So there you go. All right, my friends. So we did most of it. So we did get pretty far. We will definitely continue on with this painting another day. Sorry, I'm just trying to make sure that they all stick. I hope everybody has a good rest of your Friday and or Saturday, depending on where you are in the world. I hope everybody has a good weekend. And I shall see you later. Bye, my lovelies.